watch and talk about them. They want to trend on the trending sites. Then they want to retract what they say. So, oh, did I say something offensive? Yeah, you know what the hell you were saying. You just said that because you're trying to get numbers. So I will tell you guys, don't give Bill O'Reilly any credibility. Bill O'Reilly about to be in the dun box. <laughs>
You just said that because you're trying to get numbers. And, you know, Bill O'Reilly keeps going off on, on different tantrums. If he sticks really hard nose and be like Lou Dawes or one of those people out there where you know you're going to get real good, solid information, you can agree or disagree. But when you got to go that low b- b- below the belt and hit up an 80-year-old black cranky woman who needs to stay in her old hole anyway and get everybody upset, including the blacks who are conservative, you stupid and you a fool. Bill O'Reilly, you a fool. A lot of you guys are out there cracking jokes, doing memes on Facebook and stuff about Maxine Waters. And y'all know I am not a Maxine Waters fan. But baby, when you mess with a black woman and her hair, you done crossed the double line. Because white people got fake hair too. Don't get it twisted. Stop messing with that woman and her wig when half them white women, you know, got all kind of extensions and lays and blaze and, and glaze and glue all in their hair. But then you're going to go after an 80-year-old black woman and not even stick to the facts and the ideology of why you're attacking her from a political standpoint. You have failed the city, Bill O'Reilly, and you need to be done. Leave that old woman alone. Let us beat her up on other antics. That's all I'm saying. I'm done with that. Make sure you follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat. This is the Shirley Hussar Show and Shirley's World. I appreciate y'all for watching. Thank you so much.